show that, but I can't show that. Maybe something Bear with me. Don't. tonight. I miss my couch, so I don't know if I'm going to like this. might not have a lot of people here because it's late, but that's only because I had an issue with my computer once again. No, I'm not. It's 8.30.
There's not I don't know if I like sitting at this table for a live. I like my couch. <laughs> it's more comfortable. Hey, yes! what are you doing? Weirdo. Barking at the damn box. have to see how it works with the with the channeling over here because I always have to be comfortable. I try to channel outside and I could do it. It's like my comfort zone is my couch or something where I do my best channeling. We'll just have to see how it works.
let's get in here and say hi. Looks like we only have three people. It's probably because I'm late, I know. But that's okay. We'll do it anyways, regardless. And it'll just be posted. So, yeah. Poppy, no. No. I don't want you to sit up here. I tried to make you guys see the backdrop, but unfortunately, I, I can't. I don't have anything high to put my camera on. I think it's just too high up on the It wasn't Denise. It was um, Chastity. It's okay, me too. Oh God, is there another spider? I need to go see my cats are. Maybe I'll make sure there's no spider over there. Get down. I'm gonna go check the spider. Hold on, I'll be back. Please don't let there be a spider. What are you guys doing? Is there a spider there? What is it? <laughs> there's no spider i don't all the cats were like in the corner i was like what are you guys after there's nothing over there so i don't They're here. I just, that's why I said, I don't know if you guys want to see them. I was trying something different. I got a table today and I wanted to do a pick your card um, video after this. So I just set it up and I thought I'd try the live here. I don't know if I like it because you really can't see the babies. You just see, I was trying to make so you guys could see this because it's really pretty, but um, I think it's too high because it's just my normal. I have it on all the time. Um, I'm kind of not comfortable here, like to do this kind of. I don't know. I feel more comfortable on my couch. Um, so, I don't know. Do you guys like it here or should I go to the couch? I don't know. Like this, I got this for like, um, you know, cars and pendulums and stuff like that. Because uh, I'm going to start doing the guidance thing, but I kind of miss my couch. <laughs> So they're here, it's just they have nowhere to lay behind me like these holes, so I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. If you like it here, I'll stay here. Otherwise, I can go over to the couch. Because I know some people like to see them. So besides this reading, I wanted to talk about um, the three, the last three cases that I worked. Um, I found some areas. 
I don't know where I want to go. I was trying this out just because, like I said, I wanted to do the video after I got off my live. Which I don't even know how I'm going to do it because of the way my camera sets up, but I like I'm kind of missing. I will. I actually put it on the description too now. Um, it'll be interesting. I, I really honestly don't know much about the case. Um, my mentor told me don't work it years ago, but I know I kind of want to move. If I use a pendulum, I can always come back over here, but I kind of want to move. I kind of want to go where I'm comfortable. I think I'm going to move just because, I don't know. I, I like being comfortable when I channel like that. Hold on. And I'm kind of late because I had to set everything up and then I freaking couldn't get my computer. I was having issues. I had it on 175% or something. I had a more comfortable chair and it was a little higher. I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Let's move. I like my, I like being comfortable when I do this kind of channeling. Hello, Tina. Welcome. Sorry, I decided to move back to where I normally sit for now. I'll just save that for my cards or whatever, whenever I feel like I'm in the mood. Um, hello, Joy. Okay. All right. I'm more comfortable now. My, my leg is hurting, too, my ankle, so. Extra pen. Oh, what did I do with my pen? I just freaking had it. Oh, hold on, I gotta find the damn pin because I just had it and now it's missing. I'll have to grab another one because I don't know what I did with it. I do have extra pins now, thanks to Shazam. Shazam sent me extra pins. So, I just had one and I, I don't know where the trick I put it. How weird. It disappeared. Disappeared into the air. Watch out, bud. Move over. Okay. Dude, I don't know where it went. It, like, disappeared from there to here. <laughs> so, welcome all the new people. It's good to see you guys. Sorry, I'm a little late. I had issues. I had to do, like, I kept trying to go live, like, three times, and it kept messing up because it was, like, set on 175%, and I couldn't get it to go low, and then I was, like, I don't know, something made me check something, and I got it to work. I got it to go smaller because I couldn't see the next button. So, I even shut down my computer thinking it was just my computer, but <laughs> only me, right? Um, and I did a little bit of pendulum work before, and we're going to go into the possible locations I have for the last few videos that I worked. Um, like I said, pendulums are hit and miss. I haven't really had one validated yet, so I can't promise you this is where they are. This is where I feel fits my reading. And um, so the pendulum saying yes to the questions I ask. So hello. It's good to see some new people here. It's awesome. And thank you for saying hi. Oh, um,
I used to have a rat named Daffodil. Love that freaking thing. Sweetest little girl ever. Okay. So, if you feel so inclined, there's donations up on top. There's super chat. Um, hit the like button. There's 18 people in here and three likes. Come on, guys. It'll help my channel grow. It'll help me my videos be seen. So, hit the like button. Um, if you have not already and you're in here, please, 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 takes two seconds. Um, also, if you guys go back to the description, there's other ways that you can support me. There is a podcast out, the Psychic Sleuth podcast. You can actually find it on <clears throat> cool. There is a podcast called the Psychic Sleuth podcast. That's my podcast. I brought it back, but I have a new co-host. We've done a few cases from Lauren Spear to um, Brent's I guess it's, I thought it was Brandon, but I guess it's Brenson. I guess he went by both Perry. Uh, that's cold case. Um, there's a few others that we did. I can't remember them all right now, but you can find it on Spotify, Apple. I posted on my wall, all the places you can find it at. Uh, it's basically anywhere. I think that you can listen to podcasts. And also I post the regular link on in the group and on the wall. So um, that's don't, don't miss out on that. I think it's really good, especially the last reading that we did. There was a lot of validation. So check that out. <coughs> Excuse me. And, um, there is merchandise. There's some people that have already gotten sweatshirts that like them. There's t-shirts, tank tops, whatever. So there's merchandise down there. There's my book. You can find it on Amazon. Um, R and R love a twin flame story. Link that's down below as well. If you need to get a hold of me for a reading or a case, my email is there, or you can hit me up on Facebook or uh, Instagram. Um, oh, Patreon. I have two Ted Bundy readings up there now if you're interested in that. If you're interested in that, um, my Patreon link is there. I'm going to be getting another one up real soon, hopefully this week. Um. And I think once I get a, some watch more watch hours, I'll be able to do a membership on here because I already filled out the stuff for the membership. So then I'll be offering some things that way. Um, yeah. So that's all that information. Check all those things out. Oh, TikTok. If you have not followed me on TikTok, please do so under the Psychic Sleuth. Once I get a thousand followers on there, I can do some readings on there as well to help everything move along. So before I get into my disclaimer and all of that kind of stuff, because we're not starting the reading yet, I, I wanted to go over a few validations um, from random auto rights and from random visions that I got um, the monkey pox. So random auto right, I think it was four and six. I kept getting um, kids being broken out in pox or measles or something of that sort. And then the monkey pox had just come out recently. Um, I have posted about a school shooting in 2019 by a gunman. I'm unfortunately, I think that's what happened today. Um, it's weird because Madeline, I got the name Crispin or something like that, and I got that when I did when I got that random vision. So it's weird because there's a there's a street named Crisp right by there. I kept getting Columbia with that, so I'm curious if the guy's actually from Columbia or has some kind of Colombian heritage. Because I couldn't figure out why I was getting that. But, um, so that's just validation, unfortunately. Uh, I just like to validate things only because it just, it just, uh, you know, just, it's just validation. That's all it is of my gifts, I guess. So, um, I did a little bit of pendulum work. And, yeah, I did. I got that in 2019 was the weird thing. Um, it was a very random vision. So I posted the stuff on the wall and in the group. All right. So I did, I have, I've been working on the few locations for Madeline, uh, Cali, Cali boys and uh, Michael Vaughn. Can't promise you. These are just, <coughs> I keep having to cough. 
wondering if it's already spirit. So, um, I feel very strongly about these areas, so I asked the pendulum. Now, the pendulum is an extension of me, so, like, it's never been validated for me, the pendulum. Um, but I use it in hopes that, you know, it'll be correct and can give me information that I may not necessarily get or know or whatever. So, these are just possible locations. Um, so, for Madeline, okay, because remember how she showed the... Okay, so she showed, like, um, well, I thought it was abandoned. It looked like an old abandoned, like, building of some kind, and I kept seeing it being torn down. So we found out that one of his, um, one of his shacks, so it, it could have been a shack because it looked, like, really dirty. You know what I mean? Um, one of his shacks in Germany um, was torn down. It was bulldozed or whatever. They they tore it down. They searched there and everything. So they do probably think it's a possibility that he could have taken her to Germany. That would have taken three days. So that could be the three days. Um, there's a lot of validation we found out in that reading with the three and the two. Um, so there is a... there. So we found out where the shack was. Um, it's by Wolf something. It's all in German, so... I kind of just asked about if she was, you know, in this area by the shack where the shack was torn down because she kept telling me the shack being torn down. Then she, you know, when she did the thing, showed me the three major things that I felt were, and he has more victims, so the other stuff could be for more victims. But the three biggest things that he, she kept showing me was the forest very strongly or a bunch of trees that was like a forest and a castle. Um, there is a cat, actually there's a lot of castles by where this, um, the shack was, that was torn down at. So there's a huge castle, like right across and down from it. Huge. There's a wooded area behind there. And then where the shack was, it looks like there's all kinds of castles throughout the woods there. Not a coincidence, I don't think. And also I kept getting two. Remember things can have multiple meanings. Number two highway is really close to there. So it's possible that could fit. So I asked the pendulum if that's where she was at. If she was. Okay. So I asked if she was behind the shack in the woods. And I got a no. I asked if she was in the behind behind the huge castle um, where the woods were. Where I was very drawn to. And I kept getting a yes. And I asked that multiple times. Yes. So. Um, hello Carol. Long time no see. You've been, uh, you've been gone. So, anyways, that's what I get for Madeline. I think she's by the shack that they tore down. And, yeah, you have to watch the reading. Um, I went over all that in her reading. I'm just going over the locations right now because I was trying to get it um, validated. Or I was trying to make sure that where I was picking up was right. So, that's where the pendulum says that sh that she is. Um, and that's why we were having issues with the board and the letters because it was in German. And actually the D makes sense because 40 minutes from there is where another girl went missing that they want to connect him to. So I feel it's very relevant. That's actually the name. It starts with a D. So I, that could be what they were trying to say. I don't know. Um, I cannot remember the name of this place, but if, if you find out, you know, you look up where the shack was that they tore down because she kept showing me a bulldozed building and then castles. There's literally a castle right there. Um, so I think that's where she's at, possibly in the woods behind the castle or in that area because the castle came through pretty strongly. Or in an Orson. Um, so I kept asking about the physical remains being in the Kern River in a tote um, at Oil City, close to the bridge, and I kept getting yes. So that was multiple time that I asked that. I asked about being findable. I got a yes, and I asked about divers, and I got a yes. So I feel like whatever I said in that reading was right. Um, that location is correct, and it should be checked. Um, however we can get that done, I, I don't really know because I've never listened to. So just wanted to say that pendulum agrees with that um michael vaughn 
So the pendulum says he's alive, which is what I was feeling anyways. Um, and what's weird is I found... I don't know if this is saying this is where he's at because I believe it so much because it's the only thing that matches what I saw and it makes sense. Um, there, Remember how I kept getting... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> um, so... And Michael Vaughn, you guys remember how I kept getting the name McCleary? That's okay. Whatever you don't see, you can just remind. But rewind. But I kept getting McCleary. Remember that? It came in like three times. Okay. So there is an East McCleary Road about an hour and 30 minutes from where Michael Vaughn went missing. I also asked if he was in the area where he went, if he was in the same town where he went missing. And I got a no. This was obviously way outskirts. Um, this area... It's weird because remember how I talked about the street went through two um, two fields. Like, so alfalfa fields go in a circle, right? I just found that out. So there's this road called East McCleary, and it's an hour and 30 minutes away. And it's between two alfalfa fields, the road is. And they do have livestock and everything. It's a really big farm. The McCleary guy that owns it is like 90 something years old. Like he doesn't live there. So I really don't know who lives there. Someone was looking into it for me. Um, it kept saying that's where he was at. So whether that's true or not, I don't know, but it is near a state line. It is near the river actually runs through there. Like there's a lot that fits, including the name. Um, that's the only McCleary I could find. So there's that. Um, like I said, pendulum, grain of salt. I mean, I don't know. It's never been validated now. I just have to tell you guys because those are areas that I feel very strongly about. And then I checked the pendulum and it said, yeah. So, again, pendulum is an extension to me. So, not sure. With that being said, that's what I feel about those cases. If you have not watched them, please go back and watch them. Then you'll know what I'm talking about. You can always fast forward through stuff that you don't want to hear, like the beginning or end or whatever um so information can be passed thank you copper um information can be past present or future symbolic or have multiple meanings spirit will often use my experiences and or references to try to explain what they are trying to say Oftentimes, it can be a little bit like charades, but I do have my own symbols and things for stuff. Um, so, <laughs> getting sidetracked. Sorry, guys. Actually, I haven't even cleared yet. <laughs> okay, sounds good. I know I got on here late, not on purpose. It sucks because all my everybody's like far ahead, you know, ahead of me time time wise. Make sure you hit the like button before you leave, Natalie. <laughs> That's my co-host by the, with for the podcast, by the way. So, like again, if you guys have not listened to the podcast, please, did you happen to listen to it? And ASMR. So I'm sorry, I'm clearing. I forgot to do that, and then I'll get on with my what I was saying. You love it? Good. Cool. We'll be getting on another one soon as well. So if you guys haven't checked it out, please do so. Okay, and you can always, like I said, rewind what you don't get to see. All right. I actually don't know much about this case. I don't even know who they have in custody or if they have anybody in custody. Um, you just hit it. It's just right there on the video.
Um, you know where you're watching at? Just at the thing. Uh, so, anyways, okay, so what I was saying is, past, present, or future, symbolic, or have multiple meanings, spirit will often use my references or experiences to try to explain what they're trying to say. Um, you guys can validate. You guys can validate in here, whatever I come up with. If you know, you can validate. Please don't give me any extra information, okay? I don't want to know any any extra information in case I get it. And I don't like to be led in any way. I'm just going to give you what I get. That's it. Um, don't know what I'm going to get. Can't promise I'm going to get anything. Um, but I usually do. So, uh, can't promise. I don't know what I'm going to get. This is for entertainment purposes only. These are not facts. Psychic medium impressions. And... Um, everyone is innocent until proven guilty. Okay. Um, so I, I don't get distracted. I'm not getting distracted if I look off. Okay. If I look off, I'm trying to hear or see or whatever. I'm, um, Yes, for the podcast, we need a picture of the guy of the last podcast we did. Um, could not find a picture of him anywhere. Anyways. So, yeah, I'm not distracted. I'm just trying to get information. Okay. Scribbling on my paper, getting information, blah, 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 blah. Again, you may validate in there. Please don't give me any extra information. And, again... I don't know anything about this case, really. I It's another one I haven't really looked into or been into. But for some reason, I wanted to do it tonight. So I'm just going. And, you know, some people are saying, well, you're doing a lot of popular cases. I'm just going where I'm drawn. And I'll do a mix of cases. I'll do not so popular cases. I'll, I'll do whatever I feel drawn to do. So that's what, that's that's the way that I'm, I'm picking what cases I want to do. Okay. Right now, I'm just going to pull up a picture. Yeah, she got it. Thank you, Copper. Yeah, don't ask questions. Um, because that'll throw me off. I'm just trying to freaking... Why is it taking me to Facebook? Hold on. Yeah, and if you guys haven't checked out my world events, please do, because stuff is happening that I've said for years. Um, and I will ch I will fix her name. I thought it was, I, I spelt it completely wrong. I will fix it. I don't know why. See, I told you I don't know anything about the case. I always thought it was spelt that way. So I'm going to, and if I get things that are known that maybe I know, okay, I'm never going to say anything unless it comes to me. Okay, so I'm not just going to say stuff. I'll only say it if I hear it, see it, whatever. Okay. So, because she, she might show me stuff she liked to do or that she did. I'm going to use that picture. Okay. I don't know why. Just... <sighs> okay. Let's It's going to take me a few minutes. I can try. That's another thing. I am offering a class. So let me know if you want to join. I have posted the what it's going to be about and everything. You'll just have to email me. I need more people for it. So. What are you doing, dude? Seriously, what? What do you want? Come on, I'm trying to do something here. What? My dog is wanting to, like, sit on top of me. Sorry, Jim. 
Okay, so I'm just trying to connect right now, okay? Oh, one more thing. Shazam is getting a new channel going for missing people. It's called uh, um, Vanished and Forgotten. So make sure you look for that. We're probably going to collab with it maybe one day. But for now, it's just missing people. Okay, she's trying to bring some awareness to missing people. So make sure you go and subscribe there. Thank you, Denise, for the super chat. Appreciate it. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to connect right here. Okay. I think she's the one that's been making me cough already um, earlier. Okay. She's showing me a window. A window being open. He, he used something to climb through the window. This guy feels like he was um, possibly from the around the neighborhood because I want to put him close to the neighborhood. I don't want to put him away from the neighborhood. I think a lot of people thought the brother was involved, but I'm not getting family related. Um, and I feel like uh I want to put him in black. Oddly, I don't. I don't really know why. And I feel like he stepped on something to get through the window. I don't know if he attended. He attended some kind of party or um, attended some kind of event where they were at or where he saw her. But I feel like I don't feel like he lives too far. Um, I just keep hearing, like, hearing the window. It's one of those windows that slides up. Um... I don't know. I just see him stepping up on something. I don't really know what it is, but I can hear the window being open and possibly even propped open. I don't know what it is. It's dark outside. As I try to see, it's, I just see dark. And I, it's weird because like I feel like he's in black. I don't. I don't know if that's just symbolic for like, you know, how you would think the intruders would be dressed. There's something about three o'clock in the morning. I'm seeing that on the clock. I keep getting uh I keep getting a um Okay, so do you know if he if he attended? Because I feel like he attended something or he attended. He'd been in their house. I don't know. I hear the word worker. Like maybe he did work for that work for them or something. I don't know. I hear the word worker. Right. I feel he attended, but I feel like he did some kind of work for them. Um, <sighs> it's 
sorry. I have like a sore arm from overusing it. Um, I keep feeling... Okay, I feel like he did work for them. I, that's coming in strongly. I heard the word worker. I don't know what kind of work, though. But for some reason, I keep wanting to put... Um, no, that's okay, Shazam. She was validating what I said. She didn't give any information. Neither of them did. I already said I think he attended something, and they said, yeah, they think he attended the Christmas party. That's validation. That's fine. So I think he did work for them. That's what I'm saying. Um, I keep getting, like, it's weird. Does he have Spanish or Mexican? I don't know if he's mixed or full or what. Um... I keep wanting to put, like, a Spanish link on him. I don't know why. Or Mexican link. Uh, I don't know if that's just someone connected to him or if he looks that way or if he is that way. Like, darker skin tone or something. I don't know. It's weird, like... Okay. Um, all right. So, again, this is someone that worked for the family. I feel like I feel like I'm doing, like, work outside. Um, I want to say he did work outside because it's weird. Like, I see him... I see him standing there raking and watching her. But I also feel like he attended something at the house. He got fixated. There's a fixation on her. She's so she's so pretty. Um, I I get the word fixated. He got fixated. It became like an obsession. Um. Skipping forward. They're going to be skipped. I think she's going to be skipping around a little bit. Sorry. I think he's got some kind of Mexican heritage or Spanish heritage or something like that. Or he looks it. Can't shake that. The tan skin and the darker features. And... I see him... It's weird. I wonder if they had people that um, were, like, did work, like, um, I hear contractor, but that could be many things. Uh, but I, this is like yard work. Like, I see him raking something up. Like, raking leaves or, like, doing that kind of yard work, and he sees her. <coughs> I keep coughing, like. Um... Okay, so she's showing me how he came in the window, okay? Like, he, he scoped this out. This was a... He planned this. He planned it. He planned when he was going to do it. Like, he, he would watch the house. He would watch the house for the perfect day to come in and do this. I don't know why I'm getting May. Link to her or him or something. Um, but also January... But he was so fixated on her. He started obsessing. There's an obsession feeling here. Um, and she shows me him going in the window. I think he had gloves on or... I still want to put him in all black. It's weird. But... I keep saying gloves. But at the same time... I don't know. There's a reference to some kind of fingerprint. So that doesn't kind of make any sense unless he took them off for some reason. I don't really know. 
Like, I don't know details about this case, so... Um, I see him going through the window. Was the the window? It's weird because the window feels like it's downstairs. Like it feels like a lower window. It's not a high window, but he still had to step on something to get in the window. That makes sense. Um, like it feels like the windows possibly down, like downstairs, not upstairs. But he'd been in the house before, so he knew which room was hers. I feel like she was taken out of her bed. I lost my picture. Hold on. I feel like she was taken out of her bed. Um, that's what I'm seeing anyways. I see a, a hand go over her mouth. Trying to see if um, uh, the front of my neck is hurting. I keep hearing ligature, but I feel like he carried her somewhere. He carried her back downstairs somewhere. I want to go down, down, down. Um, downstairs, down. Like, down somewhere dark, like like a basement or something like that. Um, there's, there's something with the, there's something with the panties. I don't, I don't know what. They were used as a ligature, or I don't know. There's something with them. I don't really know what what it is. So because of the fixation and the obsession, I do feel you know she was sa. There's sa there, and um, during the same time that she was strangled with the ligature because the front of my throat hurts as well and that's why i've been kind of coughing on and off since we since we got on here um because i haven't coughed all day um And I hear he went out the way he came in. I feel like I'm walking a ways before I get in a car. I don't know, a car's, it's kind of dark. I can't really tell what color the car is. It's, I think it's a dark color. But I don't feel like he lived too far. Like, I do feel like he drove there. Like, I don't feel like he's, like, a, a direct neighbor. But um, he doesn't live, like, way far away. So, I'm a little confused now. I'm trying to see him better, is what I'm trying to do. Because, like, before, like, I was getting... I was getting like a Spanish Mexican guy and now and I don't know if that's a connection or whatever but now now I'm seeing a white guy. So I don't really know. I don't really know why it's why it switched like that.
I keep hey, just calm down, Cheyenne. Um, it's okay. She's been doing that lately. I keep feeling uh like heaviness to him, like he's a big guy though. He's a big guy. I hear the word okay, this is weird. I don't know. I hear the word Johnny Walker like um like the drink. And I don't know, maybe that's what he likes to drink or he was drinking or um because I kind of don't feel like he was completely sober that night, like he'd had a few drinks or something. I don't really know why I'm hearing that. It's kind of weird. I feel like a heavy, like he's a heavier guy though. Like he's not a skinny guy. I keep wanting to put a T initial for some odd reason. trying to get more about him i there's some kind of i don't know if he's done something since then um i want to connect other cases to him but i don't know if it's just you know pedophilia stuff or if it's something more They keep showing me it. It's weird because he's like, I got away, you know, I got away with it. But then they keep showing me like a girl in the woods. I don't, I don't know. It's maybe a case that connects to him. It's kind of weird. Mm. I don't know, the T's like first, middle, or last. Um, trying to get more on him for, for some reason. I'm struggling with that. I do, again, I feel like he worked for the family. I feel like the family knew him. I see dad shaking his hand. Um... And again, I feel like he was at January keeps coming in. Um, I don't know why, but at the same time, I know you guys said Christmas, but I keep getting Christmas. Okay, don't tell me things. I don't want to know what other psychics got. I, I don't go by what other psychics get, okay? Um, John Bonet was already found, so I don't know what you're talking about. Um, That's okay. But John Bonet was found, so I'm not sure what you're I'm not sure what you're talking about. Um I am I'm trying. I'm trying to get more on him. Just be patient with me. For some reason I'm struggling to get more on him and I don't I don't really know why. I feel like he's in his fifties now. He's a bigger, he's a bigger guy. 
What's confusing is I don't know why they're giving me like a Spanish feeling and then a white feeling. So that's kind of weird. I don't know if maybe he works with Spanish people or he has some in his ancestry, but maybe he doesn't really look it. I don't really know. Um, Because then they show me like later white. And I don't think there was more than one person involved. Like it doesn't come across that way. Cause, but he's a bit. He's definitely a bigger guy. I see fat hands. I see fat hands, fat fingers, fat hands. Um, bigger, bigger dude. Like more stout. I get the word stout. With like fuller face, like cheeks. Um. Try and get a name, but you guys know every time I push for a name, I get a bunch of other names, and so I'm just going to try to let it come to me because I'm not, I get the word Chatsworth, but I don't know what that means. Remember, I can get interconnects, so not everything I get may fit here, so just keep that in mind. I forgot to say that. Um, I hear Chatsworth. So, I don't know, maybe there's a link there, or that could be a last name. I don't really know what why I heard that. Um, but I always get everything for a reason, so keep that in mind. Uh... I hear the word work truck. So he possibly had a work truck. Um, or drive, drove a work truck. Because again, I feel this was someone that the family hired to possibly do yard work. Or he did yard work. I also get the word James, name James. So, again, it may fit here as a connection, first, middle, or it may just be a, another case, but um, also Richard. So, names are connections or first, middle, last, and not always here, but... Um, I try to get it to fit here, but sometimes when I try too much, I just get other names or whatever. I don't know why she's talking about a toy box or says the word toy box. I don't really know what that's about either. Keep show me a crown. I mean, I know she's in beauty pageants, but I keep seeing that, so. I'll say it, because she keeps showing it to me, so. Hmm. Family knew this person. We kind of knew him well. Just get this like when he saw her, it's just like a fixation, obsession. Like, he just couldn't stop thinking about her or wanting her or any of that. Um, okay. Okay. <clears throat> 
I keep showing me him in jail, so I don't know if he's currently in jail or was in jail or there's some kind of, I hear the word rap sheet. And I don't know if this was after because he wouldn't have been working for the family if he had one unless he hid it from them. But there's something, some kind of something there. Like maybe he's been caught since for something else. But I keep seeing another girl in the woods like that may be missing from the same area around the same area that was possibly found. Um, that links to him because they, they keep showing me that. So he must have been responsible for that. And that's why they're showing me. Um, I keep getting DNA, but new, like new DNA, like, um, there's some kind of new DNA test that they will run or they can run or needs to be run. Um, it's going to be, if it has not already out a new, I hear new advancement. So from her clothes or something like that, I don't know. They just keep showing me like things being tested from her case. Um, And getting a, I think they're going to get a hit because I think he's in the system now. I don't think he was in the, like, I don't know why, was this, I don't know when this case was, early 2000s? I don't know. Um, I feel like I want to go to the early 2000s for some odd reason. Okay, what did something happen in there? Uh, Cause did something happen in the two thousands regarding her case though? I don't know what. Um, cause I was gonna go to the nineties after that. But I hear familial familial DNA. So I don't know if they can use the familial DNA. Um, I don't know. I don't even know how they do that. I don't know anything about it. Like if, I don't really know how they use that. I don't know. Um, she's talking about a cop that has a suspect that's the right suspect. Um, just needs evidence. I don't know if there's a cop or a cold case cop that's been working on this or reopened it or something. But she's talking about a specific cop that has taken over the case that's on the right path. Um... Um, so if any, if any cop sees it, if that cop sees this by chance, which I doubt, um, on the right path, on the right, there's, I feel like there's a suspect that they have is the, is the right suspect. Um, or someone that they've thought about or that's crossed their desk. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. This guy's got really fat hands. Like he, she keeps showing me his hands. Like they're fat. Chunky, chunky hands. On all the stuff I'm saying. I, 
I really feel strong about the name James for some reason. I don't know. I'm getting a pain in my stomach for some reason. Um. They just keep talking about a DNA hit. It's going to be a DNA hit from some kind of new advancement. And then I hear the word solved. So. Technological advancement. Let's look at the name Chris. Again, I don't know how it fits. I'd be curious if they can check into um, there's going to be I, I'd like to know about a case where they found a girl in the woods around there um, maybe close to or a surrounding area I feel um, it's linked to him Possible DNA match to that, too. I don't know. I keep getting that. I keep getting there's at least one other case. In the lease. There might be more. Um, Because I keep seeing this girl in the woods. Um... Her mom's passed too, right? Because I keep seeing her holding her uh, holding a um, motherly figure's hand on the other side. Okay, so she says, you know. A lot of people said when my mom passed and she never got answers. She has answers. She knows. She knows the. She knows everything now. Um, I wish I could get everything. Unfortunately, you know, you know how that works. I tried Etsy. I, I didn't do well, but that was a long time ago. But. Um. Yeah, I was going to say I kept saying a bald head, so that makes sense. She knows. I mean, she's with her and she knows. So, you know, everybody that says, well, she didn't get answers and all that, she knows. Can you ask your rods about um, whoever was doing the rods? I can't remember who it was. I think it's you, Anne. Whoever is doing the rods, can you ask about the name James, please? That's the jam. That's the name I feel strongest about. It's the first, middle, or last, or first or middle. It could even be last, I guess, with that name. I don't know. Um, I also hear the word coming. So. I don't know. I know that there there's another little girl named Cummings that's missing, so I don't know if it's for her. Um, like I said, I get interconnects, so if not, I mean. Okay. There's a James connection. I don't The only other names I got were Richard and, and Chris and a T, but I don't. I keep seeing him in um, 
in orange, like, like he's either in jail now or he was in jail. I think he's in jail now for something unrelated. I don't know. I keep seeing him in orange. So either he will be, he is or was. Um, I feel like there's someone that he worked with that knows what he did. Um, there's someone, there's someone that worked with him that knows what he did, or or thinks that he did it, just because of the way he was. Like they thought he was creepy, or they saw his fixation. Um, okay. So there's someone that's connected to him. What? James Kohler is an honorable man who has risked everything to tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth in the job. Huh. So I wonder if I'm picking up the fact that he knows the right guy. How weird. Okay. So so that's still a validation. Yeah, dude. I keep he's a big dude. He's a big dude. He's got wide shoulders and fat hands. He's a big dude. He's not a little dude. He's not a little dude. So if he then he must he must be on the right track, this James guy. Because like I said, I keep being pulled to that name. Also Travis. I don't huh, I'm just getting random names now. Um they might all connect, you know, or they might be other cases, but they might all connect. But that's weird because that's a T, so It's weird because I was just getting, but there's someone, okay, so there's someone besides that James guy, unless he worked with him, I don't know. There's someone that worked with him or knew him that was a friend, probably a friend and worked with him, because I'm getting kind of both, Um, that, like, has suspected or has thought or knows that he did it, Um. so... I really think it's going to get solved, though. I really think it's going to get solved by technological advances in DNA. Um, hold on a second. Did you take my pendulum off? Sorry, Jennifer. No, give me that. Shit. No, don't go there. Back up. Sorry. My pendulum, my cat stole my pendulum. It's the last thing we want. Dragging it throughout the house. Um, oh, okay. Well, I did say there was a cop, so that must be who I'm picking up on. Because I kept saying, remember, I kept saying there's a cop or an investigator that knows who it is um, that would fit that. Who's James Kohler on the, he was the lead investigator of John Benet Ramsey case and he hasn't exactly been keeping quiet all these. So he's, he knows, like he has, whoever his suspect is, like I was saying earlier, whoever his suspect is, is the right suspect. Um. I feel like I'm hearing notes like he needs to go back in his notes or something. I don't know why there's like something there that is like super important, but okay. Um, dude, my cat's like that table a little too much.
why I keep getting presents and stuff? Oh, was this before or after Christmas? Because presents either is a, it's either a birthday celebration or sometimes it reminds me of Christmas because I want to go to the end of the year. So it's, it's one of those, you know, coming up or just past birthdays or, again, Christmas. Um, that's because that's like a symbol of that. This is on Christmas. Oh, okay. No wonder I'm getting pregnant. Oh my gosh, stop. Hey, leave it. Roscoe's being a crazy person right now. Um, that's why he's getting presents. Okay. Okay. All right. That would make sense why I was getting presents. Okay. See, I didn't know that. Okay. I, I had no idea it happened on Christmas. Okay. Leave it. Uh-uh. You don't have that in your mouth, do you? Good boy. I also keep seeing a red vehicle, and I don't know why. Um, so there's a red vehicle connection somewhere. Should have put all my damn crystals away. My freaking cats are playing with them. I don't know. Oddly, I keep hearing the word boss. I don't know why. I do want to put darker features on him, though. Yeah, she has a specific message for that, that cop, because not only did she say his name, but she said that he's, he's on the right track. It's like he holds the keys or holds the answers um, for whatever reason. Like, I don't know. He's put things together like puzzle pieces. That's what they need to do is look at the employees anyway. The employees that were friends that also were at the party. But there's a red there's a red car connection. There's, I don't know if he had one or has one or where the red car comes in, but there's a red car connection. Um, I keep seeing it. It's like, kind of like a small car. It's not a large, it's not a huge car.
This is a weird, like, word or name, and I don't really know where it fits, but, like, Pinkerton? I have no idea. So. Um. I get the word regal, too. I don't know if she's describing the cop or if that's another name. These could all be connections or, or different cases. I'm not sure. Let's say what I hear and that's it. There's something with, um, No, because I see somebody come in the window, so I don't think that's right. Because I know everybody thought the brother was involved. I'm not getting that, though. This was a work... I don't think that's right. Unless it's a different cop that she's talking about. I don't know. Um... We need to look at the. Hey. It's okay. Hold on one second. I need to get this from my dog. Hold on. I should have put my crystals away because I knocked them down. I didn't even think about it. But knocking that pistol off. Yeah, I don't like I thought I thought that because I know a lot of people thought that, but not from what I'm seeing about climbing in the window and stuff. And, like, yeah, no, this feels like an obsessive. Like, I see her and I have to have her and um, she can't be a witness. And I, you know, I have to kill her in the middle of the act and all that. Like, if that's how, that's how it comes across. So... Trying to get more on him, guys. There's something about pool or pool cleaning, so I don't know if he did that job at one point as well, or if he did that for them. I'm not sure. Um, but there's something about that because I can smell chlorine, and um, there's something about something about him doing pool cleaning at one time. I don't know if it was when, like, during that time or if it was after or what. Hello. Almost ran out of ink on this. Okay. possibly in jail for an unrelated crime. I just keep seeing him in orange, so either that's going to come or he is in jail. I don't know. Someone said the rod said he out of that, but like he's got like a chubbier face, chubby, chubby cheeks, chubby cheeks. 
bigger face, wide shoulders, thick hands. Like that's, I think I'm getting how he looks now. I don't know if that's how he looked then. Um, he's a like chunky dude. I don't think he's little. I don't think he's small or skinny. That's not how it comes across anyways. Um, I do like, it's weird. I like it a, um, between like sometimes, I don't know. I'm trying to see because it's kind of weird. Like how I see him, like he kind of looks Spanish, but he kind of looks white. Like, I don't know how to describe that. He's mixed or something. Um, it's like there's both. It's like there's, there's he's a mix of both or something like that. All you guys in your eating, you're making me hungry. Um, I, don't know, I hear the words, he will stand trial. So I honestly feel they're going to come across some kind of DNA evidence, like a new thing that's going to lead them to them. But they need to be looking at, they need to be looking at the people like, um, the workers, the workers and friends, the workers and friends and pe people that were at that Christmas party. I feel like they overlooked him or something a while ago. Um, let's try to get that, try to get Charles again, I don't know, in that name, I mean, it's a popular name, so. I'm drinking tea. I don't know. It's just Charles. That I keep getting. So I don't know. It could fit here. It might not. Because I get that name a lot, but it is a popular name. So I'll just say everything I hear. Either it's going to fit this case or it's going to fit somewhere. Because it always fits somewhere. Um, I'll look at an Andy. But, like, again, I don't know if it's him, connections, or what. And um, it could be just because I'm trying to get a name so hard that I'm just am pulling... That's okay. Um, Barcroft or Bearcroft or I think I got something like that before. Or I need to go through these readings and type them out so I have it. But um, that name sounds like I got that before, like Bearcroft or Barcroft or something like that. I don't know how that fits either. I still get the pool cleaning with him and I don't know if it was at that time or like after or just I don't know it's it's important for some reason uh Shazam can you try to see if there's another 
missing girls case, like either before or after um, John Bonet that was found in the woods in that area or anybody, um, because that keeps coming in and I want to link the case to him. And it's like they could get get him for both cases. Um, I don't know. I keep wanting to link that case to him for some reason. Hey, Chastity. I'm really trying to get more on him, you guys, but I don't know. Um, sometimes when I try too hard, it has the opposite effect. she like to dance like I see her dancing and singing well, that comes in dancing and singing Yeah, I want to put on 50s now. I think I'm getting how he looks now, but like I get, I want to put a mustache on him too. Like this kind of mustache it goes like this. Like I want to put a mustache on him. Um, and like I said, like either brown or dark brown, maybe even black, but it's a definitely. I want to go to more towards brown, but like a darker brown, I think, but. His beard might, or his mustache might be a little lighter. He's got like, I'm telling you, he's got chubby cheeks and like a thicker face. His hair may have some gray in it now. Because I see like, um, like black ones got a little bit of gray, not completely salt and pepper. Um,. He feels like you got away with it. And there's a friend that I don't know if he's going to come forward or he wants to come forward or he's thought about coming forward. Or I don't know, like. Keep getting this friend or something that's connected to him that, well, back in the day, I don't know if they're still friends or someone that worked with them that just, like, saw the kind of obsession with John Bonet and, I don't know, I think maybe throughout the years he thought, but he wasn't sure. Like, that comes in. Like, he has suspected him. Mm. It's okay. You can always rewind it. Um, I don't know as much. I don't know if I'm being much help, honestly. Because I'm just trying to really focus on this guy and get that, as much information as I can on him. And Sorry, it's taking a little long and coming in kind of slow. But... Um,
also an April length, but I don't know if it's to her mom, you know, her or anybody connected or him or anybody connected alive or past, but it's, I want to put it, there's an April connection somewhere. Yeah, because I think I'm almost done getting information. I'm getting, like, super tired. I don't think I'm going to be able to do my card thing tonight. Um, I don't know if the red car was connected then or later on. There's definitely a smaller red car, like... Kind of looks like a little sports car or something. I don't know. Um, not like tiny though, but definitely getting a red car. Sorry, guys. Also, get the name Mark. I'm getting a lot of names, and I think it's just because I'm trying to get. A name for this, and I mean, I could be pulling them from and other cases and stuff. So Barcroft is kind of sticking for some reason. Faircroft or Barcroft. So he keeps showing me like a tool belt, so I don't know, like if he was a handyman or he did handy work or he was a contractor of some court, some sort. But there's a, you know, they show me the tool belt as a reference to what he did and what, what he did and back then, and I think continue to do, but. I feel like for some reason in this case they seem to have tunnel vision or something like it comes across where they were down they were down one road and um okay hit off Barcroft on my rod so I think you're on the right track the pool man got a hit too I think so too because like that came it's weird because that came in another case I just did recently I think Madeline. Um, and so, uh, sometimes I get stuff prior readings before I ever work on the other than the reading next or know I'm going to, it's kind of weird how that works. That happens to me a lot where I get the information like the case before or something, but, um, it's weird because I've never, I mean, that's not like a name I will come up with. Yeah, there's a definitely a smell like chlorine and like get a reference to the pool. But also, I think this guy, like, he's, like, almost like a jack-of-all-trades. Like, I feel like he does yard work, or he did, did yard work. He did, con like, um, contractor work, handyman work, and possibly even pool cleaning or pool work. So, that's all. That could be the pool guy, too, that I was seeing in Madeline's. Like, that could be why I was getting that. Because I also remember I also got a house in hers, like, in the beginning. It could be it could be this house. Look, like, maybe it was an interconnect. Like, maybe she started coming in first because I talked about her earlier in the day, um, John Bonet. So, um, they're kind of similar cases. So, that could be why they interconnect like that. Did any of the other names get a hit? Um, Mark, Chris... Richard. Uh, Travis. Those are all Andy. Those are all names that we need to check. I don't know why I'm getting all those names. I don't know. Um, Yeah, 
Kendrick, you know, I wish you used the stairs. Come on. Oh, girl. Chris. Okay, that makes sense. I did get that name. Okay. Weird I wouldn't get wolf. It's my favorite animal. I wonder why they didn't just show me a damn wolf. Um Okay. I did get Chris. Is he a bigger guy or no? Do you have a picture? If you can send me a picture, I can tell you because I can I can see him pretty clearly now. I was struggling for a minute. I said it a while ago, but maybe you weren't. Maybe you were doing there what you whatever you said was going on. I said it a while ago. Um, there's still a connection to Barcroft though, but I don't know if it's. I don't really know what the connection is because like I don't know. That's like one thing that keeps coming up for some reason. I'll tell you guys right now. What is, is this an old picture, huh? They don't have a new picture? This is not what the... Wait, let me see. I don't know. It doesn't... Stop fighting weirdos. I don't know. Like, I want to know what he looks like now. Okay, get out of here. Um, that's like, that's an old picture, right? If you can find a like a more recent picture, that would help because I can't find. I need like a recent. I need a recent one because he doesn't look like who I see, but. That doesn't mean anything. Sometimes we see them a different way. But I need to pull up her picture again. <sighs> Where do you think you're going, dude? There's like nowhere to go. Thank you, Ann. Woo woo. I'm freaking getting tired. This is I don't know if that's the right guy. I mean it could be. It's just not doesn't look like 
who I see. Keep getting, I keep wanting to put a mustache on this guy. Like, one of those mustaches that goes like this. And I could be completely wrong on how I'm seeing him, I guess. Um, I could be seeing the older version and not how he looked back then. weird because I see like him outside of the house like fantasizing and being like stalkerish. There's a stalker vibe I get. It's like once he saw her or like was watching her and then he's like fixated on her. Weird. And he like couldn't stop the obsession and feeling. The only the only way he thought to stop it was to do what he did. Okay, I got a no on Chris Wolf, but I mean, again, Pendulum is. Do you have a picture the digest DNA the governor outside source okay that could be it too there's something like I said with DNA that's gonna happen and I don't know if it's a new I feel like it's an either a new kind of DNA that comes up or there's something kind of there's definitely something with the DNA so that makes sense um and I don't know if it's gonna be that or something else but Yeah, my pendulum said no on Chris, too. I don't think he's the one. He doesn't look like who I saw. I don't know if they... I don't know. If, I think he was a... I think he's been a suspect on somebody. But I don't... I think maybe he was overlooked or there wasn't enough evidence or they just... I don't know. Um, okay, I got May. Okay. Um, I got May, so that could be why I got May as well. Do you have a picture? Who Who is the Santa supposed to be, though? Do you have a name for him? Yeah, I don't think my pendulum said yeah, no on that. And that's an old picture. I don't think that's him. I don't think he's the one. But I get suspects and connections and all that, so keep that in mind. Like, Um... Yeah, but he also had, I'm telling you, there was also, this was an employee, but also a friend, but also, I still get an obsessed feeling with her. Now, the obsession could trickle down from the family, but 
there's still an obsessed feeling there. Um, it's fine. Okay, guys, don't give me extra information, but thank you. Um, I don't know, something happened at that party. Did he have an argument with anybody at that party? Does anybody know? Is that mentioned anywhere? About an argument over money or not being paid or job done or there's some kind of feeling of something that went down at the Christmas party or around the time of the Christmas party. Um, that comes in. As well. Weird. I get the name Less. Like, Less. I don't know why. It's kind of odd. Mm. Maybe that'd be why I got boss. Like, Dad, like Dad was boss. So, there's some kind of so there's something that happened that caused an escalation thing. I keep getting money, too, for some odd reason. Like, maybe dad owed money to this person or didn't pay him for a job. Or there's something There's something about that. There's something about that. Dad feels in a way responsible. I think that's why he's fought so hard. Because I think he feels in a way responsible for some reason. Like he couldn't protect her or he has guilt of some kind. Um, It's almost at eight. Oh, okay. Oh, that's okay. Sarah was just validating. I just I just mentioned money, so that was okay. I already said money, so she's just validating that one. That was fine. Yeah. Well, that's why the money's probably coming in. But, again, it was more than that. Like, I still feel an obsessed feeling. And it could be the obsessed feeling of I'm obsessed and really pissed off and I'm going to do this. Or I'm, you know, I'm pissed off but I'm still obsessed with her. Like, there's still an obsession feeling there. Um... I didn't even know there was a ransom note, so I wasn't showing that at all, oddly. And maybe that's why Dad has guilt. Like, I don't know. Like maybe he thinks it was his fault in some way. Like, he couldn't protect her. That comes across really strongly. I'm getting like super tired, guys. I'm not getting much uh, much more. Um, I did. Okay. So that's probably what they're gonna test. I do think it's gonna be it's gonna be solved through DNA, I think. 
I think everybody will be like surprised about it, kind of. Yeah, but that's not how she died. No, that's not how she passed. She was strangled. Ligature. That came in. I mean, I don't there's probably other stuff too, but that was the main cause. Are you sure it wasn't a bug? I have lots of bugs in here, like flying bugs. Could be easily be a bug. People think my bugs are orbs. <sighs> Let's get the name Douglas. I've gotten that before. Now it's just getting crazy. All the names I'm getting coming in. They could be people that were suspected, people that are connected, different case. He could be in there somewhere. Oh, Chastity, I don't think I'm going to get my dang cards done tonight. I'm too tired. This is like draining me because I'm trying so hard. Yeah, that or a bug. Yeah, I think he's in jail for something unrelated. He's either been doing jail time or he's in jail now. Because I keep seeing him in orange jumpsuit, which is my symbol for jail. Um, somebody did rods and they got that he's in jail now. So he's either in jail now or he's been in jail like recently or some, there's something like that. Um, like I think he's still alive, yeah. I think he's like in his 50s or something. I mean, he has the mustache. I wasn't getting longer hair, but I mean, I seeing him and he doesn't have the chubby face. I don't know. Um, I, I mean, he doesn't seem right either. Who's that? No, I don't know. The guy has darker features. I'm not getting white. I'm not getting white hair at all. I'm just I'm telling you, he kind of looks Mexican and then he kind of doesn't. No, I haven't asked. I haven't asked that. Um, I keep getting that, though. Like, I keep getting a, a Mexican or Spanish tie. But then they showed me a white guy, so I don't know if they were just showing me another, like, um, another suspect or if they're saying he was mixed. I don't really know. Yeah, okay, it says it says Mexican or Hispanic, whatever. I don't like to use Hispanic because my ex used to say, What do you mean Hispanic? Because he's he's Mexican mix. He's like they're they're not from Hispania. <laughs> so um 
I think he's Mexican. That's what my pendulum says, and that's what I'm seeing as a Mexican guy. Like, I don't even know if there was any Mexican guys there or that had an issue with him or a beef with him. Or I don't know. But that's what I keep. That's what I keep seeing too. So the white guy I could have seen, because could be like another suspect that I was seeing then. No, it's okay. I don't know what to call him either. I'm Mexican, Hispanic. I just say that because that's what my my ex used to say. Okay. <laughs> so, I mean, I always say Spanish, but they're different. Spanish and Mexican are different, but that's what I keep getting. It's weird. Like, You know, he kind of looks like, um, if any of you guys have seen my Delphi drawing, he kind of looks like him. Kind of. Not completely. And I might not see him exactly as he is either. I mean, we sometimes we do, sometimes we don't. Oh, thank you, Anne. Very much for that. Could have just PayPal that to me. <laughs> I can't get my. Well, maybe I can now. I don't know. Um, haven't been able to get my super chats or anything. Appreciate it. Thank you. I'm telling you, yeah, he does come up. And my pendulum says he's Mexican, too. Me, too. We'll see. Maybe I can now with you and the other one I've gotten. Um, I don't have my cloth over here, though. See, it's giving me yes for that. Hiya, I'm sure. See, because that's what I keep seeing, too. Telling you, I don't. That's what I got since the beginning, and I just I can't shake it. So, <sighs> oh. okay. Does anybody know if there was any Mexican um, suspects in this? I don't know if he's been like a suspect suspect, though. I think he, they just, I think maybe he's on the suspect list or like he was there. Like they had, they had his name or they had something, but they didn't like really look at him hard or I don't know. It's just, I feel like he's been there. But I need to look and see something. I was trying to see if there's any Mexican suspects. Like, I, if I saw a picture of him, I think I would know. I don't see. See, there's a mark. I got that name. That was a suspect.
I don't know if he was cleared or not, but his middle name is Mark. So that could be why I was picking up Mark. I'm not trying to look up information. I just want to see a picture of a, like if they had one. I don't know if they've had him as a suspect. Okay, he was, yeah, but he was still a suspect and I got Mark. So, like I said, I get suspects, whether they're cleared or not. I get names and connections to the case. So, just like, you know, I can get areas where evidence is. So, it fits how it fits, basically. Um, so, because he was a suspect, like I said, first, middle, last, I got that. So, that's why I picked that up. Some of these guys that I've been picking up could be because um, they were suspects or they're connected or whatever. I don't know that this guy, I don't feel that this guy has been looked at, looked at, looked at. Um, I think there's been a lot of false confessions because I hear false confessions, but nothing that was actually substantial or correct or right or whatever. Why ever, why anybody would want to take the heat for this? I don't know. Maybe to make them famous or I don't, I don't know. Um, but the guy feels very much in the shadows in regards to this. Now, again, I think maybe there's, a cop that had suspected him at one time or thought about him at one time or like he was there and he had it and he let it go. There's something to that. Um, and again, I feel like there's going to be a DNA hit. Like the DNA keeps coming up because this guy, I don't feel like he was in the system back then, but I mean, he might be in the system now or something. Like, it's weird. I don't know. Maybe she was his first and something came after. You still can't get that kid in the woods that's connection. Or the, it's another it's another um, female child that's connected in the, in the woods. Um, mm -mm. No. I keep getting... I'm telling you, I keep getting a Mexican... Or Spanish or some some kind of that. Dark features, mustache, thick cheeks, thick, bigger face, thick cheeks, thick cheeks, thick mustache. Got dark hair with a little bit of white mustache here. Um, bigger guy, fat hands. And this is, I think, what he looks like now. Now, what he looked like then, he might have been skinny or whatever. He might have looked similar to how he looks now. But I don't know if he put on a lot of weight or he's just bigger now. Bigger guy, not skinny, chunky. Okay. Um, and again, I don't think he's been on the suspect list as far. Because when I typed in Mexican suspects in John Bonet, because I wanted to see if they had any, I'm not seeing any. I'm just curious if there was one that worked for the family that, like, worked in the yard or the, you know, the pool or there's some kind of connection to... God dang cat, really? That cat always goes after Roscoe, of course. Always goes after flies and moths and stuff in the lamp, and he always knocks it over. That's like the tenth time he's knocked it over. So now my lamp's on the floor. Um, but I mean, it does come in as an employee and a friend, like employee friend, both. And it's weird because I do think he went to the Christmas party because I see him like walking around looking at things or I don't know. But again, I don't know if he's been one of those suspects that's like been out there, you know, like maybe his name is on a list somewhere. That's why I said I heard you need to go back into the evidence, back into your list of names that you have. Um, someone that needs to be looked at further, or closer, that's possibly in jail now. So there's the names that they had back then are the suspects or people that they talked to, um, because I'm sure that they talked to all these employees and stuff. Um, and then again, there's a friend of this guy who suspected him, but, and, and he might not look completely, you know, some of them look little you know, look white. But to me, I just keep pulling that. Keep pulling that.
I know I'm not getting much else, honestly. I like just went blank. Plus, I'm getting like super tired and hungry. Um, I also hear the word brutal. So I think there was more brutality to this than I was originally getting. Did mom find her? I keep hearing, I keep seeing mom going downstairs and screaming or something like that. So I don't know if she found her or not, but. Okay. Well, the, I'm wondering if when dad told her that mom screamed, I just keep hearing mom screaming. So. I don't know. Um, okay, that's probably what it is then. Okay. I get the name Phil, too. There's lots of names that are coming in, but again, it can be suspects or connected or, like, another case. I don't know. Um, I need to type all these readings out because... Okay. Looking lights laying on the floor. I do. Well, I keep, like I said, I keep seeing him in an orange jumpsuit, which to me tells me jail. So he could be in jail or he was just in jail. There's a, there's something with jail or prison. And he's light, but he's lighter skin, um, Mexican, Hispanic, whatever you want to call it. It's not like dark. I'm not dark. I'm lighter skin, but I have like a, like, you know, tan tan to the skin olive color maybe or but on the lighter side dark features it's coming in like an either dark brown or black but again the mustache is really prevalent keep showing me like a thick mustache right here and his hair kind of goes back like this kind of thick it's got a little bit of white in it now like i said i think he's in his 50s or, no, that doesn't sound right, does it? Who would have to have been really young back then? I don't know. I get 50s, so that could be late 50s, too. I don't know. Um, if you send me a picture, I'm waiting to see, like, a picture that I'm like, oh, yeah, that's... That's him. Um, and, and maybe the cops, I mean, I don't, cops never watch my stuff, so I don't know how we would get the information to them. But I feel like who I'm describing, like, they would know. I think, I hope. And I'm, like, I'm more focused on him than what really happened, because I guess a lot of people know what really happened. Like, I just got the basics, because I'm trying to figure out who this guy is and what, everything. 
Like I said, it's going to be solved. It's going to be solved. I feel very strongly about it being solved through DNA. They're going to solve it with DNA, like new advancements or something in DNA. Um, and what, you know, what's hard and what people, you know, have a hard time understanding is this whole contract stuff. Like, this is also, you know, anytime anything like this happens, it's, it's hard to understand from a human perspective, but... It is soul contract. So. And she knew that when she made her soul contract. I don't connect with her really strongly though. Um, I was just saying. I don't really feel like that strongly. But it could be because I'm getting tired. Um, I felt like. Uh, Madeline was stronger. Downloading photo, Sarah. Oh, huh, it's possible. Do we have a do we have a picture of him older? I mean it's possible. He looks more he looks more what I'm looking for. I mean, he kind of looks more Spanish or something. I don't know. Looking for a Spanish looking guy. Um, and you might just look at, like, I don't know. Okay, I'm getting a no on I'm getting a no on him though, Sarah. The Meyer kill John Bonet Ramsey. I don't have my little cloth here. But I'm get I keep getting a no on that. I mean pendulums are when I say, I always say, take with a grain of salt. Yeah, no. Dark features, not light features. Dark, dark. So, I don't know if it's probably brown eyes. Like I said, olive, maybe a little bit lighter. He's got a black mustache. I'm sure it's got gray in it by now. His hair is kind of like combed back like this. Dark gray um cheeks bigger fuller face bigger guy really fat hands showing me a ring on a finger so i don't know if that's marriage or not i'm not sure um i just see i just they just show me a ring on there um i don't know i don't know i just know he looks it i don't know if the is it but On what? On what part? Hiya. Hiya. I don't, I don't, hiya. Mm -hmm. On what part?
I need to see this person because I, I just got a name, but it doesn't look anything like it. <sighs> no, dark features. No, he's too white. I don't know. Um. I just don't know if he's been like a huge suspect. I think his name's on, like, I think his name is on a paper somewhere in the files of the cops or something like that. No, remember, it uh, said Glenn didn't do it. That's what my pendulum said, anyways. So why? I don't know if this guy just looks at or he is. I don't know. I'm getting too tired to get any more at this point. This is fr it's frustrating. It's always frustrating trying to see who did it and get a name and stuff. It's always frustrating. Again, I feel like it was a worker... New dad, well, worker comes in. Um, that comes in strongly. Someone that worked for the family in one way, shape, or form. Trying to see if there's anything else I can get because I think I'm done. Um, I'm just not getting anything else. I freaking feel like I want to pass out. I'm tired. Um, and I don't even know if this reading's been helpful in any way, shape, or form, honestly. And I don't even know if I'm seeing him right because. I have to just trust I am seeing him right. He doesn't seem like a skinny dude. He seems like a chunky dude. I keep getting like bigger cheeks. Bigger. I, yeah, you know, I know a lot of people thought that, and I was going, thought I was going to go in that direction. Um, but I just kept seeing someone come through the window, and since the kid was in the house, that kind of doesn't make sense. And again, they keep giving me an older male. So, I mean, all the information that I got, I don't know. I mean, maybe the, maybe something, um, maybe, maybe something will, like the cops... He wanted to hurt the family. That's the thing. He wanted them to find her in that way. This was not only personal, 
besides the fact that he had, you know, like I said, an obsession. It was an obsession either getting back at dad or her or both. There's there's an obsessive feeling there. Um, and I'm hoping that what I got, I don't know. I mean, maybe one day a cop will see this and be like, okay, or maybe this DNA will come out, like I said, and it'll be solved and then it'll make sense. Um, but I feel like his name, I keep seeing his name on a paper somewhere. Like they, um, they put his name on a paper. That's why I heard go back, go back, go back in the files. I need to plug my phone in real, or my computer in real quick. So it doesn't, um, shut off on you guys because last time it did, well, at least my thing didn't fall all the way down. It's not on the floor. Because last time this freaking thing turned off on you guys and I lost you. Hush, it's okay. You don't even bark. You don't freaking bark. Um, and I got a lot of names on this, but there's a lot of suspects. And there's a lot of pop people connected to the suspects. So, I don't know. Um... I keep seeing a. I keep seeing. It's okay. I keep seeing a name. Stop, Cheyenne. It's okay. I keep seeing a name written on a paper, put in a file. It's just like on a little piece of paper, put in a file. It's like they had the name on the suspect, but they overlooked it for some reason, or it didn't make sense, or they didn't want to connect the guy, or something. There's something to that effect, because I just keep seeing. Dark features, Sarah. Dark features. I mean, I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Like, I, I, like, I need to find a guy like I described, but I don't, I know, but he would still have our older, he doesn't have all this. It's just one mustache, thick mustache right here. Dark. Black. He wouldn't have turned all white. It's not, that's not what I see. Salt and pepper black with a little bit of white at the top and his hair kind of combs back like that like kind of higher comb back um mustache black i think it's black i want to go black or a really dark brown but i want to go black here um i mean i'm only seeing like he could have longer hair but i just see the top um and again, thicker. He's got chubby cheeks, a bigger nose, kind of a round face, um, sideburns. I keep getting sideburns. Uh, oh, by the way. Um, yeah, I kind of don't want to watch any documentaries like i haven't even watched the one on madeline because i don't know if i want to revisit the case especially you know i might get more information if i do the case a different time like sometimes i like to revisit cases to see what new information i can get i do feel like i'm telling you they wrote his name down somewhere they had him on a list he was either bypassed or they just didn't think he was a suspect this is going to be this is going to be someone who um, who they didn't really think, I think there's one cop that maybe, I don't know why I'm getting the cop, like, possibly is the one that wrote his name down or kind of suspected him at one time or something to that effect. There is one cop that, like, had him in his sights or something, and then I don't know what happened, but I keep seeing his name written down on a piece of paper. And I keep getting an R, too, whenever I look at that name. Written down on a piece of paper and, like, shoved in a file. That's why she said go back into the files. Go back. Go back into the files of, I don't know if they, just go back into the files. Get the boxes out and go go back and look through everything again. Um, Because they're missing something. There's something that's being missed. There's... There's a suspect that's being missed that was a suspect. Um, I 
Yeah, and I don't even know if you're going to be able to find him because I don't know if he's been out there like, you know, a suspect that has been in the news or anything like that. Like, I don't think he's, I don't think we're going to find him that way. It's unfortunately, unless there's a way to look at who worked for the family and who was at the, like everybody that worked for the family and everybody that was at the Christmas party, that was also a friend, like that's the only way we're going to figure it out. Like if I had a picture of everybody, I might be able to, Unless I'm seeing him older, I could be seeing him older. He might have looked different back then. But I think I'm seeing him how he looks now because he looks older now. <laughs> hey, it's okay. It's okay. The house was contaminated with the police. Yeah. And well, but the thing is, is when things happen, like, you don't think about that stuff, right? Like, she was probably just freaking out. And she wants some support, and she probably didn't even think about it. Um, but I don't, I don't know. It's like I can't get away from the fact that he's a worker, but I think maybe quiet. But there's something again, like there is something with money. Like maybe he didn't pay him enough, or didn't pay him, or wouldn't give him a raise, or I don't freaking know. Um, Yeah, well, true, but I guess when we go into shock and stuff, like, I don't know. Um, I mean, I'd be calling the cops right away because, you know, now we watch crime documentaries and all that. We know what to do, but back in the 90s, I mean, we probably didn't think about it. Um, I just... And I was checking Gary because I actually heard the name. Like, I know somebody said it way up there. Whoa. But um, I actually heard it, so mm -hmm. I was trying to. See, and I got a no on that, so. I mean, like I said, maybe she wasn't thinking at the time. I don't know. I don't know. Um. Is John Bonet Barry? Does anybody know? Because I heard the word burial. So. It's okay, baby. It's okay. Calm down. You're fine. What are you chewing on? Cheyenne. It's okay. You, you've been weird lately. You don't usually bark when they. No, it's okay. It's okay, Mama. I don't know. It's okay. Okay. Um, because I was hearing burials, so I don't know, did they do something to her? <laughs> to her um headstone. Oh, she's barking it out. The dogs are barking outside, but usually she doesn't bark whenever they bark outside, so she's just um, they did something like special to her headstone or something like that. There's something with her headstone coming in. So I don't know if dad added something later or it's probably just coming through as a validation. Um, but there's something special that was done to her headstone. Uh, yeah, I've talked about her in a live before. I think she's in a, he, she was in a construction site close to where she went missing and they built a hotel or something there i talked about it on a different live i'll probably do her but um it's like weird because all the suspects are white so it's throwing me off about what i'm seeing like i don't even know if they had any mexicans working for them or spanish or whatever it's kind of throwing me. That's, I mean, he could just look that way and not be, you know. Um, oh, okay. So they added her mom's name. Okay, that's why I was getting like they added something to it. Okay, that makes sense.
All right. I also hear the word anniversary. So I don't know if there's another, if the anniversary is coming up. Well, yeah, December, I guess, huh? Duh. Um, so that kind of doesn't make sense. This is a different kind of anniversary. I don't know when Patty passed. I'm still at the month of July for some odd reason. Hmm. I don't know. Um, it's weird because I also keep getting tiara. I know that she was in the pageants and stuff, but I don't know if her dad has a tiara, kept a tiara, something like that. That comes in. Um, well, that's something you might not be able to validate, but yeah, tanner skin exactly. But he looks Mexican to me, but he might not be. He just might have that look, but I think he is. And it's, like, weird. Like, none of the suspects that I saw, I'm like, nope, that's not him. That's not who I'm seeing. It's got to be right. It's got to be right because I'm not... Um, Hey, what are you doing? I should have picked up my crystals. That was dumb. Uh, well, again, soul contracts, okay? Soul contracts, we all have lessons. We all make mistakes. We have the contracts with the people. Murderers and murder victims all have contracts with each other. It's not really judgment on the other side. We all come here to learn lessons, fulfill contracts, create, clear karma, that kind of stuff. Um, dude, I should have put them all away. I was stupid because everybody's playing with the damn crystals. Did you drop the crystal? Who dropped the crystal? I heard it. Um. Oh, okay. Well, since we were talking about her, maybe that's why I got anniversary. I don't know where I have to go look at it. I don't know. Um, I just put crystals out because I was going to do the card readings today, but I just don't think I can. I'm like half asleep. This is really draining for some reason because I was trying so hard, trying so hard to see him, trying so hard to see anything I could get, any name, anything. So I don't know. I hope that these clues help. Um, I hope that. It sucks because the cops never watch my stuff or anything like that, but they would be the ones to know what I'm talking about. But like I said, it's going to be a cold case detective. That's what I feel like. There's a cold case detective that relooks at everything or something like that. Because um, a cold case detective keeps coming in. And I hear blow the case wide open. So it's probably going to be a cold case detective. I don't think it'll be one of the original ones. They have cold case detectives on this, though. That's what I hear. Cold case detective. I also hear the word shrine. So I don't know if there's a shrine to her somewhere. I don't know if it's at the burial or I'm not really sure um, why I'm hearing shrine, but that's coming in as well. Also, weirdly, I hear jailhouse snitch. So, I don't know. Um, I don't know if maybe he's told someone and they're going to rat him out. Or he is going to tell someone and they're going to rat him out. But I hear jailhouse snitch as well. Yeah, but it would have to be one on this case because, you know, they take specific cases unless he asked to take it over. The cat's playing with it. <laughs> it didn't fall. The cat, one, somebody dropped it or something. I don't know. My freaking light fell down too, so that's not helpful. All right, who's got my crystal and what are you doing with it? The amethyst, I think. Oh, baby. You tried to meow and nothing came, huh? Nothing else. 
Oh, he has? Yeah, they were playing with it. It's this one. It's like a little... It's a, uh, I think it's an amethyst. Yeah, it's an amethyst like quartz thing. Um, amethyst is my birthday, so it's kind of funny. But well, maybe then I don't know. That's good. I'm glad, Denise. I don't know, Sarah. I don't know if he'd be interested in listening to these, uh, listening to this and seeing what he thinks. Um, it, it's worth a try if you wanted to. And you can vouch for me because you were with me on the few cases that we have validation for. So. I don't know. It's it's always so hard. Yeah, exactly. That's why I said since you have so much experience and you know, like, you can vouch for me because, you know, you know how it goes. No one likes to listen to me. It's kind of ridiculous. Um, and they should. They should listen because I think I get pretty valuable information and pretty accurate information. And I think that everything that I say should be taken seriously in one form or another. Um and I get really frustrated because I, I, I don't, no one listens to me. Like, like there's possible that I'm getting, I'm getting stuff that maybe they haven't thought to look at. Or they've overlooked that they can go back and look. Like, that's why she's saying to go back in the files and try to find this piece of paper with a name on it. I keep getting an R with that, weirdly. I also hear Ruiz. So I don't know if that's connected or not, but. Um, yeah, R. I like, I keep seeing it written like on a piece of paper and then just shoved in a file. I mean, I could go over all the suspects with this pendulum and see, like, which one they, which one the pendulum says. But, and I may do that. But it's just none of them look like what I saw. Um, you know. So I may do that. I may take all the suspects and check it. But I think, I think if they were the right suspects, like there would have been something. But again, I think DNA is going to solve this. DNA and a cold case detective. It all comes in together. And them going back in the files and looking at this. If you guys are, everybody's going to be surprised. It's going to be, yeah, everybody's going to be surprised. They're going to be surprised at this, this whole thing. They're going to be like, huh? Um... And I don't even know if they even had, like, Spanish guys around there is the thing. Like, like if he even hired them, I don't know. That's why it kind of doesn't make sense because you guys keep showing me white people. And I'm like, no, did he even hire, like, Spanish or Mexican guys? Like, because that's what I keep. And he could just look that way. He might not even be. But it just, that's just what he reminds me of. Like, he has, like, an ethnic look to him. I can see him pretty clearly. You know what I need? You know what I wish I had? You know how they have that program where you can take the faces and add like the things and make it look. I wish I had that. It's, you know, instead of drawing it out now that they have this and they put the different features on it. I wish I had that. That's true, Sarah. You're right. Um, Gardner would make sense. Um, 
because I was getting him raking leaves and stuff, unless it's connected, like, the same kind of, let me look, let me look at that guy and see, but I'm, it's not. He's bald. No, not him. Dark creatures. If that's him and he's bald, no. Unless I'm not finding the right picture. Some of these pictures are wrong, I know. Because we tried to look up the one guy for... No, his hair's too short. No. Like I said, ethnic looking. He's Mexican or ethnic looking. No, I got that, Chastity. I got like a... Like, like he's a jack of all trades. He does... I saw him raking up leaves and doing gardening. I saw him doing pool work. I saw him doing handyman work and having a tool belt. Um, so I've, I've gotten kind of all that you weren't, you weren't here yet. I don't think, um, he like does all that. Yeah. I don't want a bald guy, dark hair. that's kind of combed back. Um, it could be thinning now, but it's got a little bit of white or grayish to it. Um, uh, black mustache. I, mean, I want to go black on his hair. It's like a really dark hair. He's got dark features. Mustache. It goes like this. I keep drawing it because that's how I see it. Like the mustache is like right here. And it's thick. Um, thick hands. Really thick hands. Chubby hands. Chubby cheeks. Okay. Rounder face. Bigger nose. Um, bigger guy. Like I keep seeing him and I keep saying the same stuff over and over and that's how I see him. I don't know if I'm seeing him now or back then, but he could, you know, he could lost. He could look different now. Um, and like I said, I don't know if he's Mexican or he just looks Mexican or look ethnic because of the dark features. This person has really dark features. He could be, he could just look that way because some people look that way with their dark features or he actually could be, but um yeah that's Dave that dude's totally white it's possible I want to go towards Mexican though the way that I'm seeing him but um and usually people do have I hate to say it but a lot of their landscapers are, and workers around are are Mexicans because that's the kind of work that they do and that's not being like racist or anything that's just the way it is um, they like the labor work, or they do the labor work. Not that they like it. Um, but like I said, I kept smelling the pool, so he possibly did pool stuff. But there, I need, I need to find that case that I keep seeing where there was a, there was a girl that was found in the woods not far. It's like either, it's either in the same town as Jambonet or a different town close by. Where there's a girl found in the woods that I feel like could be tied. And I can't shake that. I don't have the oh, I don't have the name. I just have an R. I said Ruiz, but I don't know if that's I don't know if that's it, but I just get an R. Like whenever I see the name on the paper, I can only make out the R because it's like scribbled. Like it's hard to read. So it's I see it on a piece of paper or shoved in a file. It might be on a paper even by itself, just shoved in a file, like a smaller piece. That's what I see. It's okay, baby. Yeah, I think I got it.
It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's just outdoor dogs. So you're fine. You're fine. You're fine, baby. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's, fine. Shh. it's okay. If you're going to be doing this, you're not going to be able to be out here when I do my readings. You need to chill out. Yeah, I got it. He's not He's not what I'm looking for. The link that you sent me, dude, he's totally white with white hair. No. No, 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 no. That's not what I'm getting anyways. I mean, I could be completely wrong, but I explained the guy that I keep seeing, and that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You weren't paying him no mind for months, and now all of a sudden you're paying him mind. It's okay. No, it's okay. It's okay. Um. And I think if you, it, I think if it was the <laughs> photographer, then I would be, I would have gotten photographer instead of everything else I got. Shh. His name's an R though. But yeah, no. Mm. <laughs> Cheyenne, stop, dude. You're fine. Cheyenne. I think they would have gave me that instead of saying he was a laborer or worked in the yard or was a worker. No. No. I mean, he does start with an R, but I don't think so. Worker. Hmm. Worker. Yeah, I know. I got an R, but like I said, I can get suspects, but it might be someone completely different with an R. This is a worker. This is a worker. I see him do labor work, so raking up leaves, messing with the pool if they had one or somewhere, um, handyman work, like all that stuff. I didn't see anything about a camera, anything about a photographer. He looks, he's all white with, with white hair. No. Um, that's not how I see him anyways. So, fine. All right. I mean, I, I described the guy a few times. Hopefully it's helpful. I want to keep repeating myself. Um, at all. So, yeah, I don't want to keep repeating myself. Well, my dog's outside. There's something going on out there. All right. So I think that's all I'm getting on this case. Um, it totally drained me. I'll have to try to do my other video tomorrow that I wanted to do. Hey, Roscoe. Hello, buddy. Um, what are you doing? No one wants to see your booty. As you can see, he's doing pretty good. Thank God. Um, right. But remember, when I do readings, I get everything for a reason and everything has to connect to what I'm saying. Um, unless I'm completely wrong and I could be completely wrong, but I'm usually not. I say that humbly, like usually what I say fits and connects in some way, shape, or form. And there's lots of suspects that went to jail for creepy stuff on this and they haven't, they don't have a suspect. They don't. So I think it's going to be a surprise because I keep getting, it's going to be a surprise. It's not going to be like, I don't think anybody they've had on their list. Um, and I think that the, how they're going to find them is DNA, 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 DNA. Um, 
it's weird because it seems like there was a lot of people around her or around the situation that could be suspects because they were into a lot of weird stuff. My mentor used to tell me some weird things and she told me not to do this because they were what the family was into. I don't know if it's true or not, but it's weird how many suspects they have, but they don't have anything tying any of them. It's just people who they think could possibly be it. Um, I don't know. I just, I got to go with what I'm getting. I got to go with what I'm getting and not overthink it or second guess it because I do that a lot. I tend to second guess and then it turns out being right what I had the first time. So just going to go with what was given to me and hopefully something will click somewhere. But it's like they need to go back in the files and see that someone wrote down the name. Um, Because I feel like, I don't know. If he was responsible, they would have had evidence or something like that. Yeah. But this guy is linked to the family, like I said. Friend, worker, friend and worker. Or someone who he considered a friend or something like that. Because I got boss. That could mean the dad was the boss. Or he was the boss of whatever the work was they were doing. Um... But I think that's why there's so many suspects. Because of who she was and who the family was and everything. So, and a lot of those suspects might be not great people, unfortunately. Because that's the world we live in and have lived in. Um, so, anybody else have anything they want to say? I think that's all I'm getting. Um, if you like to schedule a private reading, email me or find me on Facebook or Instagram or TikTok. Um, yeah, that's what I'm looking for, maybe. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because usually they don't do that work alone. And Sarah, you can just message me if you find anything. Jinx! <laughs> Must be psychic or something. <laughs> Alright, guys. Um, keep watch out because I'm going to be doing that card thing. I'm going to try it. But uh, make sure you guys check out the podcast if you haven't already. Psychics with Podcasts. Spotify, Apple, all the places you can get it. It's all listed on my wall. Um, so make sure you check out the podcast. This last one was really good, really validating. Check it out, man. Check it out. Yep. Get me on TikTok, please, under the Psychic Sleuth. And if you want to do Patreon, I have a couple Ted Bundy videos up there. I'll be getting another one hopefully this week. Please, if you feel like it, join the Patreon. So, follow all the things. <laughs> yes, follow all the things, please. Um, appreciate you guys. Appreciate your help. Thanks for hanging with me. I know I got on here late and everything. I know I'm kind of pushy sometimes, but I just got to give you guys and, and be pushy with what Spirit's giving. Um, I don't think he's been in the limelight. It doesn't come across that way as the, the right suspect being in the limelight. Um, yes, please follow up with me if you find something out. Like I, I actually had people follow up with me over the, the last few readings that I've done live. Um, that's fine. Uh, actually, that's what I, I prefer because then I, it's going to drive me crazy. Okay. Because I see this guy in my head and all of that. And I'm like, who is he? Kind of like Delphi. Like, okay. It's going to drive me crazy. So if you find something, please let me know. You just, you know, and if you want in the class, um, you can email me for that as well. All right. Thanks for hanging with me. I enjoyed it. 7.45, I gotta go pee. <laughs> I do, I do keep thinking about it. It's gonna drive me, it's gonna drive me absolutely insane. You know how I am, Sarah. It, if I keep seeing something, I just get drove in crazy until I find it. So, same thing with locations. So, all right. 
See you guys later. What are you into, dude?